Hey YouTube, it's my Myriad again. Um, I'm here with another review of the Oskila's 10th anniversary can from Sephora. Um, I've tried all these products finally. Um, I love all of them, I mean, some more than others, but this can is a great value. It was like $25, products that alone would just go for almost that amount. Um, um, the first thing is the um, Illuminating Tinted Moisturizer, and it is SPF 15, which is nice. I like that. I'm wearing it right now. Um, it's not very, if you're expecting it to cover, um, don't, because it's pretty sheer. It does add a little bit of a glow, which I like, and it definitely does make my skin smoother. Honestly, I didn't put anything else on top of this. I just happen to be very blessed with good complexion. So if you're like me and you do have good complexion and you don't really want to like cake on stuff, this could be just standalone instead of a foundation. Um, if not, you know, you definitely need a foundation on top of this. But it's nice. I like it. I mean, I don't know if I would buy it again because it is a bit pricey, but because it came in the can, it's nice. I do like it though. So, um, not much else to say. It's, it's nice. It's good. Not oily. It's soaked right into my skin. Um, yeah, so that's one thing. The other thing it came with was a multi-effect um, mascara. It's okay. I mean, the brush is a bit weird. Um, I haven't used one like this before. It's a bent brush. Um, it was really good at separating my lashes, and it didn't clump. But the lashes aren't really big. Uh, I didn't curl them. I don't know if you can see, but I didn't curl my lashes with anything, so maybe I should have done that. But um, this doesn't do much to curl or to volumize, but it does add a little something. I, I like it because I do tend to like neutral looking things, things that are actually subtle, so I do like it. I, again, I don't know if I'd buy it. It's kind of pricey. You can get similar things, um, drugstore price. I mean, it does have a good formula inside. I'm just not too thrilled with the brush, um, but... I like it. It's good. Um, you know, again, if you get it in a package, it's, it's fine. Another thing I got in this is the convertible color, and this is in Peony. It's, it comes in a beautiful, beautiful container. Love it. Um, I had never tried this kind, like a uh, creamy blush before, and I like it. I think it, it looks really dark in the palette. But it goes on pretty sheer. You can't even see it in this video because of the bad light. That's how sheer it is, which is good for me because I tend to be kind of red anyway, so I don't need lots of blush. But I like it. It's good. I might consider actually rebuying this because I think it's my favorite blushing product that I've ever had. Um, but this will last me a good long time because I don't use blush very much, but I like it. Um, definitely recommend it. Um, this color is nice too, so... Good. Easy to blend too. It doesn't look like it would be easy to blend, but it is. So, um, so I'm just trying to hurry this up because I have final in like half an hour. <laughs> anyway, um, another thing it comes with are it's a Stila lip glaze and it's in brown sugar. I love this. This is one of my favorite things that came in the box. I love it. Um, it's not sticky. I know some people have said it is, but I find that it's not sticky at all. It's not goopy. It's lovely. I love it. I love this color. Um, it's, it looks really dark, but it goes on pretty sheer, and I do like sheer things. I put it on top of, actually, of this Kat Von D makeup that I'm wearing, which is in Lolita, which I previewed before, or reviewed, sorry, before. And it actually looks really good on top of Lolita, which is, I didn't actually expect, because this is more brown and Lolita is more pink. But it actually looks pretty good. Um, I love it, and it comes with the infamous applicator. Like other people have said, it's a little bit annoying, because it's hard, because you, you just click this, and it's supposed to go into the brush. It's a little bit weird, because you can't really control how much comes out. But honestly, like, life goes on, you know. It, I still like this product. I would consider getting this again. And keep in mind, I am a cheap person. So when I say I'll buy something that costs $22 again, you know I must like it. I love this. I would definitely try it in different shades, too. So not sticky. Wonderful. Love it. Nice color. 
the smell it doesn't do much but I don't really care that much and the last thing is the Kohl eyeliner pencil and this is an onyx and here's the tip I love this eyeliner I don't really use pencil eyeliners on my top lash um, and I didn't I tried it on my top lash but I just don't like pencils on top lashes so I'm not a good person to talk to if you want to know how well it does on the top because that's not my thing but I use it on my on my eye on my waterline and um it's not waterproof so it doesn't last very long on the waterline but it does go on really well it's really creamy formula it what goes on I don't have to like sit, sit there and like shove it in my eye like some cheap stuff does and it has excellent color payoff I'll swatch it for you on my and there you go that was effortless glide right there and I'll let you know it does smudge really well so if you're someone who likes to smudge this smudges like as much or as little as you want like you could go completely smudge it all out all the way or you could just you know have a more subtle smudge but it's lovely I like it I would buy it again again like I said me being a cheap person a poor student the fact that I say I would buy it again is a big deal love it it has such lovely like texture like it's creamy and smooth doesn't tug in my eye and I don't feel it doesn't hurt my eye like when I put it on I don't even feel it right now and I'm wearing it right now so I love this stuff recommend it definitely and that was all that came in that can the can that looks like this which I don't know how long you can have it but I'm assuming not for very long um, if you have any questions about the rest of this stuff, like if you want me to review any single product in more detail, I will. I was just kind of in a hurry right now, so um, that was just kind of like a brief overview. Overall, the can is an amazing value. Go out and get one. This is $25. Normally, just this is $22, and like this is $18. I don't know how much the rest is, but this is an amazing deal. Like, go out and get it if this, this is the kind of stuff you want do it I recommend it definitely um, I give it like three thumbs up but I don't have three thumbs so just imagine the third one right there so yeah toodles hope this was useful peace